Io sono perplessa, non so come presentarvi la serata di questa sera. Dovrei presentarvela come un DJ set? Beh, non è stato un DJ set perché è stato uno spettacolo, è stato uno show, perché in console c'era una vera star qui al Tartana. Boy George. It's a big, big honor and I'm so proud to introduce for the first time on Enjoy Television Mr. Boy George. Hi and welcome. Hello, grazie mille. Hello. You finish right now your DJ set. I did, yes. I saw that you really enjoy yourself tonight. Because I was like, I know that in Italy, you know, it's very white here. Okay, it's very white, it's very straight. And, you know, it's like, you have to really be defiant, you know, it's like DJing and music. Music is about celebrating, you know, it's, it's about challenging. There's no point in me coming here and doing what the other DJs do, yeah. you know? Yeah. So, yeah, I had fun because I got drunk and I thought, Fafangulo, <laughs> just, you know, do your thing, you know, because there are always people that love it and there are always people that don't love it. But, you know, the people that love it are people that know music, you yes. know? Yeah. I'm not interested in other people. Yes. I'm only interested in people that have an idea of the history of, of dance music and of pop music, you know? Yes. You know, and it's like in Europe, in Italy, where there's no black people here. It's not so unusual to find you here in Italy DJing. I come here, but it's very difficult in Italy because everybody remembers me from the 80s, right? Yes. Much more than any other country. Mm -hmm. It's so, you know, because we were very successful here. Yes. So people have this Boy George 80s. I've been DJing for 15 years, you know, all over the world. But here, you know, it, it's still a battle. It's nice, you know, people are very sweet, you know. Yes, it's very, yes. mucho simpatico, you know, people are very nice. The girls are great here. Yeah. Italian women are the best. The best? The best. The because best. They're, they're more open-minded than the men, you know that, come on. <laughs> <laughs> It are two different things, but what do you prefer, DJing or singing? Because tonight you do both. I like to do both, you know, if I can. If the situation is right, you know, I mean, often I'm playing to very young crowds and they don't know who I am. You know, if they're older, yeah, they know who I am. But it's, you know, sometimes people are like, who is this fucking, you know, sorry, who is this man in the hat wearing makeup? You know, who is this man? And, you know, because of my history, there's all sorts of judgments and ideas and, yes. you know, oh, what am I, I shouldn't be DJing, I shouldn't be doing this. You know, I mean, the one great thing about DJing is that nobody tells you what to play, mm -hmm. even the owner. <laughs> I would like to talk with you about the project The Twin. Yes. Can you explain this project to our audience? The twin is really just a way of me just saying, this is not Boy George. I mean, of course it's Boy George. It's another part of Boy George, but it's not Boy George, you know, Carmen Chameleon. It's not the 80s. You know, I really feel that I'm the only person who knows the 80s are over. Yeah. Sometimes I feel like I'm the only person who realizes that they ended a long time ago. And what is most interesting about this is that at the time, everybody hated the 80s. You remember? Yeah. Everybody said it was vacuous. We were shallow, hairspray, makeup, we were, you know, we had no principles. And now because things are so terrible, yeah. so formulated, that people think, oh, the 80s were wonderful. It's like pop revisionism, you know? Yes. It's like people are rewinding and saying, oh, it was great. But at the time they hated us. Yes. I never got one good review in my whole career. Yes. Until I was not successful, then I got a good review. I remember my first good review was when I did Jesus Loves You. Yeah. And that was the first time anyone said, oh, it's a great record. Before yes. that, everyone said, rubbish, can't sing, you make you wear too much makeup. Yes. You know, it's crazy. Yes. 